the game is here, y'all. We are playing the undefeated Bengals. It's and it's raining. Last week of the season. And we've got the Bengals Sunday night prime time. Wide receiver. He's over 1,100 yards receiving so and they far. undefeated, bro. And looking for more. It's the Bengals and the Ravens. Under Purple the against the white. On Sunday night. Let's go. The Royals against the Ghost. <laughs> it's dreary and miserable throughout no one's pure. Midwest. I'll let y'all know that. No one's pure. To just say they white, no one's pure, man. No one's pure. I'm recording this at 2.20 in the morning. Crazy, right? 22. They got the best rated defense I have played in this game so far. 95 rated overall defense. Not many defenses in the league that seem up to the task to slow down their ground game. But this might be one of the They got playmakers everywhere. It's a big game. It's on Sunday night football. Me winning this game does nothing for my playoff pitcher, but it does everything for our confidence as a team. It does everything for our confidence as a team. You got to understand, when you play teams like this, it matters, man. When you play games like this, it matters. And it's a divisional game. They going to go into the playoffs. They got all the pressure on them. This could be their Super Bowl right here. You feel me? They can treat this like their Super Bowl. They beat this team. It's like, we beat them. We straight. But then they get in the playoffs, it's a whole nother monster. But Evan has this one team let's go. And we are underway from Cincinnati. Fielded just outside the goal line. Let's go. And up to about the 26 yard line, just across the 25. Here come the Bengals now to take over. And they will be let out by their rookie quarterback. 32 and 15. You know. There are always nerves involved in this moment. It's all good. That used to be the user's quarterback. But there's a reason they brought him in. We're willing to make him their starter today. Look just like his butt. No swag. Wait, let's, let's just see who he can play, man. No swag at all. It fits him just fine. It fits him just fine. We know Chubb is coming. And that's the thing. We know Chubb is coming. But can we stop it? We know Chubb is coming, but can we stop it? Feel me? We know he coming. We know they want to do that. No gain on the game's first play, and it's second down now. But Charles, as we've covered, they've already clinched their spot in the postseason. So now they just want to avoid adding any additional names to this list before the postseason begins. Terrific. We know it's coming. Trying to move up a spot. I don't know if it's worth it if you're trying to play guys. Get a hit, baby. Get a hit, baby. Get on them. They got the D, but did they have the O? And we stop the run. We stop the run. What is what's next? You feel me? If we stop the run, then what? And they saw that on film, and that meant that they had to get together. Offensive coordinator, quarterbacks coach, offensive line coach, receiver. Hey, put that pressure on Aiden. He running for his life. He running for his life, my guy. And, and when you play a good team and it's rated like that, your, your player should take that personal. Those are the things you take personal. Like, y'all really, yeah, yeah, nah, we're going to see. Because we think we're pretty good, too. That's why ratings and stuff, they good and they bad at the same time. They good and they bad at the same time. Because you have to prove it. You're going to have to prove it. Y'all undefeated. Y'all got to prove it to us. You feel me? They going to have to prove it to us. We're not just going to crown you. We're not going to just crown you, man. we just not going to crown you. Y'all came in here disrespectful, all white, like y'all just great. Let's go, baby. Purple people eaters out here, baby. Them purple people eaters. Them purple people eaters. All that distance we got, man. 5,000. 5,000 yards, baby. We about to throw a mile. <laughs> we about to throw a mile's worth, bro. Create a milestone. Alright man. We're playing the top rated defense I have ever played in this game so far. 95 overall. Stop that run. We didn't meet in Cincy. We met in uh 
Man in Baltimore. Open. Let's go. Let's go. Take what they give us, baby. Take exactly what they give us. They trying to stop my run. I can feel it. I can feel they trying to stop the run. I can feel they trying to stop the run. Hole right there. I really feel like they trying to stop my run. If we get inside position, that's six. If not, uh, we're going to see. Oh, right there. Six. Quick and easy, baby. Kick quick and easy. Quick and easy. Quick and easy. Sunday night football, baby. It's prime time. Prime time. Touchdown passes. Prime time. With the success that his team has had, I just continue to be more and more impressed. Let's both do the analysis. Prime time. Aren't we both? Yeah. I mean, and why shouldn't we be? We've seen him improve throughout the year. We've seen him settle in now, and you can see the confidence Let's go. the team has grown. His confidence has grown. I think that everyone around this Let's go. feels good about what they've seen. You know, when you punch a team that's not used to getting punched, is they don't know how to react. And that's why going perfect, being perfect in this world is hard. Because when you get punched, you don't know how y'all going to bounce back. You don't. You don't know how you're going to bounce back if you get punched. We about to see how they bounce back after getting punched. Are they soft? Or are they actually going to be resilient? You know, are they elastic or are they fragile? Are they elastic or fragile? We're going to see. And they'll certainly be trying to do better than that first drive where they went three and out. And sometimes the are they going to run and cry to mommy? <laughs> are they going to run and cry to mommy or are they going to step up and be a man? You feel me? Which one are they going to do? Okay. We're going to step up. Way to throw that strike. Okay. I see you. I see you. That's it. They're going to run and cry to mommy. I feel like they're going to run and cry to mommy. They'll get that ball to their running back. Holding. Play just like them, too. They play just like them. They do play just like the user, though. They play just like the user did. But I'm ready for that. I'm ready for this playbook. I'm ready for them. No, sir. That running game is not going to be the move, my guy. We are better. We have gained. We have gotten better. And that's the thing. Folks like, are oh, you the same? Nah, bro. You you know the old me. <laughs> you know the old me. I overplayed it. I overplayed it. They going to dick and dunk you. They going to try to dick and dunk you. And you just tackle what's in front of you. Give me the ball again. <laughs> Give me the ball again. They the first. They number one. They got 95 rated defense, bro. 95 rated defense. My defense is taking that personal. We only rated 87. We taking that personal. Good pun. Ooh. Special team. See, you need everybody out here. You need everybody out here. That was a beauty right there. Okay. Let's go, three. Let's go. That's the playoff picture. See, I'm 14 and 2 and I'm a wild card. Ain't that some jump? 14 and 2 and I'm a wild card. And you can see there is a wild card. In the division, but they have clinched postseason football. That's the important thing. They currently and we don't need to we don't need to we don't need to cover the whole field right away, right? We just need to eat. We just need to eat. One division that ends up being the top loaded division, and unfortunately this year it's theirs. But you could spin it and say, hey, they've been tested and they've beaten a lot of good teams already. We just need to eat. We just got to eat, y'all. So all we got to do is eat. It's food in front of us, right? All this food in front of us. All this food in front of us. We just need to eat. <laughs> That's how I see it. All this food in front of us. We just need to eat. 
14 and a Raven first down. Partner, it's not often oh, you expect running backs to eclipse 100 yards in back-to-back -back games, but he left 100 way behind last week. I think he's going to do it again. I'm expecting 150 or more. All that food up there, all that greenery. You feel me? All that spinach out there, man. We got to be Popeye, man. Be Popeye to Sailor Man. Popeye, baby. Popeye, eat up. Eat it up. Yum, yum. Eat it up. Eat that green, baby. Eat your spinach. And if you're a stoner, hey, you already know what's up. I see. I just. I just don't feel like they can compete. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. They'll check this one down to Carter, and he'll be brought down on the other side of midfield at the 43. And we just taking what they give us, man. They playing so far back. They got the two. They nickel, and they. They. Ah. Whoa. Good move. Good move. Good move. And he's gonna have the first down yardage to the 35. The drive stays alive. A third down gain of eight. Just control the clock and move. You feel me? Take it. Just take your time and make your moves count. Be impactful. We don't got to be fast. We can take our time, but make them feel it. Make them feel everything we do. Make them feel everything we do. We just make them feel everything we do. Send Duvernay up. They might open up that tight end. We're going to send him on that slant. And five. They did open up the tight end. You too little. You too little. To and, and that's how you look. You it's just got to know what's best. No situations. Understand what's going on. I don't got to know what you're doing. I just understand concepts and understand what will work during these certain situations, right? See, see the language when I use it right? I don't need to know what you're doing. All I got to do is understand the situation, understand the concepts, and then adjust accordingly. And adjust accordingly. And that's six, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Let's go. Let's go. Let's go two five. Get to the cribbo. Take it to the cribbo. Took the length of the field, y'all. The length of the field. You feel me? The one. First one. Let the workhorse do it. The person that put you there, the person that got your back. You always make sure they good first, y'all. And who is that? Your wife. Your woman. The one that's always pushing you to be better. You make sure they cross that finish line before you most of the time, right? Because the they deserve it. They the one that got you where you need to go. You make sure they good. Oh, you shanked it. Let's get it. Got it in there. Got it in there. Now it's up to you, eight. Yeah, boy. It's up to you. Chubb, Chubb haven't even came in the game. It's on you, my guy. Y'all get this work, too. Y'all get this work, too. Y'all get this work, too. Taking it about the one. Y'all get this word too, baby. Cincinnati's offense coming back here onto the field. Still in the first half, but this offense has struggled. Haven't really been able they to struggling. Get anything going. Not only they struggling, baby. It's man on man. We ain't doing nothing special. We ain't doing nothing slick. Chubb getting the ball. Screenplay. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. Let's go. We ain't trying to do nothing special. And one of the key things you always look for when you're evaluating a defense is how opportunistic are they? How many takeaways do they get for a game? Get song. And how about last week's game? That number Solid tackles. You feel me? Solid tackles, baby. We we rolling on all cylinders right now, y'all. We clicking at the right time. And that's what you got to do. It's all about timing in this world. It's all about timing in this world, baby. It's all about timing in this world. Let's go. Don't try two. Don't try two. Don't try two. Y'all better stop trying to because y'all scared to try one. They are scared to try one. Look, he, he just had to get it out. He's like, I got to get this out of here. Nah, bro. Give me those. Give me those. Give me those. 
Give me those. Who the best defense, huh? Who the best defense? Y'all talked all that hot mess about who got the best defense. We're going to see. We're about to see. Six. Let's go. Let's go. Walk it out. Walk it out, 89. Walk it out, 89. Walk it out, 89. Walk it out. Walk it out. Charles, every time that he makes one of these plays, I, I think the front office, they get a bigger and bigger collective score. You got holes in that defense, y'all. Undefeated where? Oh, they, don't, they don't know how. Hey, like I said, y'all, they, have they ever got punched in the face? You feel me? Do they know how to bounce back after getting punched? Can, some teams can't take a punch. They front runners. Some teams can't take a punch. And sometimes luck. Luck, hey man, luck is what gets you. Hey, it's luck, man. You gotta understand. Some teams get lucky. Some teams are blessed. Sometimes your blessings burn out. But are you skilled enough to actually earn your blessings? They just don't fall from the heavens all the time like this rain is doing. You feel me? And that's what people feel like they do. Like it's gonna come, but you gotta work towards them too, so they can come abundantly. The Bengals offense now, they head back onto the field. Well, CD, you kind of feel like they're in a bit of a danger zone right here because now you're down. The danger zone! Hey, shout out RIP Godfather to the Godfather himself, y'all. Kevin, Kevin Samuels. Yeah, and sometimes I overuse that this is an important possession. Hey, man, we at their home tour. They home tour. We got the home, the home field advantage stuff going for us. You feel me? Look at it. That Give me those. Give me those. Give me those. Give me those too. We take this person on the purple people eaters out here today, boy. Them purple people eaters out there today, boy. Them purple people eaters out there today, boy. The purple people eaters out there today, boy. Purple people eaters. We taking their souls, boy. No shame song, but we taking their souls. Get to the second level. Way to fight. Seven yards, baby. They roll Chubb all the way to this point, right? That's just like some men. They'll ride they women and do nothing for themselves. Like, they don't go 50-50. Most women, they go 100. And they men don't contribute at all to the spirit. You feel me? To the spirit of the team. Men just want to take the credit and do all the physical work. But the spirit of a team... You gotta, you gotta, you gotta contribute to the spirit, man. Gotta contribute emotionally, mentally, physically, and spiritually. You gotta contribute to all aspects of the game, baby. That's life. That's talking life. Get out of here. You he wasn't even ready to tackle. Who was that? <laughs> he wasn't even ready to tackle back there. 77 yards for him on the ground so far tonight as he has been terrific in this first half. See, they, they, it's like they, they're like they playing on their heels, man. It's like they playing on their heels. It's like they playing on their heels. Like they not playing aggressive. They ain't got no, they ain't got no, no. They just, they just getting pushed back. They getting pushed back. And we just walk home, baby. <laughs> we walk in their house. Take their Kool-Aid, everything. They're not protecting that house. This they house. We walking all over their colors. We walking all over their colors. And this defense, they just look completely unprepared for what's been unprepared, yo. They're supposed to adjust series to series. That has not happened for them, so I don't think halftime adjustments are going to help a heck of a lot. They are in major trouble unless they figure out something really fast. We hit our stride, man. We hit our stride. Ain't nothing you can do when a team hit their stride. We stop beating ourselves, yo. And that sometimes is all that happens in life. That's sometimes that's all you need in life to actually catch a break. And sometimes that's all you need to do in life to actually start getting to where you need to go and to get to where you have been working towards. Stop, stop hurting yourself. Be yourself and stop hurting yourself. Stop stepping on your own feet. Stop getting in your own way. You know, sometimes you got to sit your butt down somewhere and disappear. Give me those. 
and disappear and work on yourself and work on what you got going on. We can't win a division, but we're going to make a statement that we are the best team in this division. Fumble light. Look at him fumbling. Big boy. Get some. Let's go. When it rains, it pours, y'all. When it rains, it pours. And he hurt. Fumble. Lost the ball. And he got a man hurt. That's a triple. That's a hey, that's triple right there, man. This is just the last thing you want Last thing. When it rains, it pours, y'all. When it rains, it pours. When it rains, it pours. When it rains, it pours. Do you think we're gonna be finesse with it? No, we're gonna keep punching him in the throat. We're gonna keep punching him. We definitely gonna keep punching him. We definitely gonna keep punching him, man. See that jab, baby. You go that jab. That running back. We gonna keep throwing that jab. Oh, whoa, whoa! I'll throw it away. Throw it away because I couldn't turn that corner. I could turn the corner. That was the first incompletion of the day. The first, the first incompletion of the day. You gotta reset. Sometimes you can't play a hero ball, man. You gotta understand, man. We gotta survive to play another day. Survive to see another day. Survive to see another day. Six. Let's go. Let's go. Continue to pull away here in this first half. And remember, partner, that's a rookie quarterback back Let's there. go. Apparently, he's getting the hang of this NFL. Hey, man, I'm getting hang of this, man. Three you know? And I ain't talking about playing Madden, y'all. It's deeper than Madden. It's much deeper than Madden. It's deeper than Madden. It's deeper than football. I'm so comfortable with myself, man. It's all good. I don't need to play people. I'm teaching y'all the lessons. I look at him mad. He's like, y'all need to get y'all self together. He look how stiff he is, bro. Y'all see how stiff that quarterback is? He real stiff. He yelling at y'all. He ain't got no power behind his voice. He ain't got no power behind his voice. After the touchdown, McPherson on to kick this one away. It's like real power is shown with actions, experience, y'all. And he'll get it up just past the 20. Experience will tell you everything about a person. He got his head down. Everything. That comes with life, man. Folks got to go out there and take chances. And you got to take your bumps. Being perfect, being protected by a good team around you. It is. Being protected by a good team, a good running back, a great lady to, to protect you and all that kind of stuff. What you going to do when she need protection? You feel me? Are you able to step up and protect her and do the things that you don't want to do to protect her? Look at him. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. Get your butt knocked out now. They got Jim Harbaugh off their coach, which is probably the best coach for this team. But you got happy feet back there. Ooh, good play. Good play. They wait till they 35 down and start doing something, though. And that's the thing about it. You wait till you go down to start doing what you got to do. People have to have their back against the wall to actually start performing in this world. You feel me? People have to have their back against the wall to start performing. You get comfortable out in this world. That's why I put so much pressure on myself in the real world, y'all. I'm my own biggest critic, and I put so much pressure on myself. And my lady and my wife, she'd be like, you need to stop doing that. And I'd be like, I feel you. But if I don't do it, no one else will until it's time for me to actually perform. Like, I got to be able, I got to be ready to perform at all times. I can't just do it when it pops up. I got to stay ready. And in order to stay ready, you got to keep pressure on yourself. And that's what we do. We, we play like there's no tomorrow. You live life like there's no tomorrow. You give people your best effort every day. You don't just wait until you about to lose something or you feel like you don't need something. And I expect this. They making my defense play a little bit. It's like we ain't going to go down without no fight. No, sir. That's not going to be that easy. It's not going to be that easy. Try again. Try, try again, my guy. Try again, my guy. But don't let that stop you. Line back up and keep going at him. If I'm them, and he will take it on in for 
35-7. Okay. Nick Chubb, his 16th rushing touchdown on the year. And the Bengals are able to eat in just a But here's the thing. <laughs> they defense can't stop a cold. Able to connect on the extra point. And that'll cut the lead down a bit to 28. So they play drive covering 80 yards. And Nick Chubb, the one to finish it off. As he does so with a touchdown run. Notice how our coach was like, it's okay, guys. We're not perfect. Things happen in football. Let's continue to be us. And let's continue to do this. Make some adjustments and do what we got to do. Not yelling at nobody. We ain't got to fire nobody up. Everybody know what they got to do. And we're going to the cribbo, y'all. We're taking it home. We're taking it home. We're definitely taking it home. Like I said, we don't worry. We take it home. Let's go. Charles, when we see this offense operate, I don't know, they just seem to get more impressive. They certainly do, and let's face it, it's no surprise they're the best in the NFL in scoring. This team designs things. Taking it home, y'all. We ain't worried about them. The it's like you you getting all hype. That's how they put them on notice. You're wasting time trying to get into the game. You got to keep getting, you got to stay in the game. And you got to make it a game. You got to try your best at all times. Because you never know when someone's going to strike at your butt. You never know when life strikes. You never know when life strikes. And you never know when it strikes to the good. You never know when it strikes to the bad. People only think about the bad strikes. But you never know when life comes at you with a blessing. You feel me? You never know. And when you never know, are you ready for it? And a lot of people, they want to get ready when it comes. But you won't, you won't, you won't keep it. If you're not ready when it comes. And life has this way of testing you to make sure that you're ready when it comes for you. Because when it comes for you, you got to be ready. How do you get the mojo back? But one thing is to remember that as an offensive player, you have a much better idea of what you're trying to accomplish and where you're trying to go than the defender. So in this case, because you know it, you can make your cuts with a little more decisiveness. Maybe a second fake, some double moves, things of that nature to go ahead and try and put some pressure on the defense. I missed that. To his back right Good play. And he's able to take this I mean, he can nickel and dime me all day. I, I don't mind him nickel and dime me, man. You can nickel and dime me. So we just securing the tackles, man. All we doing is securing the tackles. You know, it's not just all athleticism from defensive linemen. Let's give them a little credit for their securing the tackles, baby. It's a fake. I call him a fake Lamar Jackson, y'all. That's all he is, is a fake Lamar Jackson. Because they did give up the touchdown run to him earlier, but shut him down otherwise. Outside of that, you're exactly right. I would say they've contained him very well. Third and four. No, sir. Hey, man. We just, we just ran out the score. Because we got to put a statement and let the NFL know that they're not who they think they are. You feel me? We got to show the NFL that they are not who they think they are. We can't just crown them the champions because they try to go undefeated. We're going to put a mark on that record. We're going to put a mark on that record. We're going to leave a scar. Hey, man. Life will leave you scars. Life will leave scars. Oh, good tackle. Life will leave scars. But some people, to to remind them of their scars in life, what they do, they get tattoos, a.k.a. scars. Tattoos tell the story of your life, of your scars. And that's because Simmons got all that stuff on him, all that playmaker and all that stuff on him. He's a, yeah, he got an X factor. And that's why that happened. They got to stop, man. Yeah, see, that's something to build upon. And if they can build upon that stop, that's a good thing. See, I'm not too one-dimensional in this. See, that's the thing. They scored and they got to stop. That's that's one good sequence because you got to have offensive sequence and a defensive sequence. You can't just score and then give up scores. You got to score and don't give up a score to gain any ground. You got to score again. You got to do twice as much in this world to gain ground on someone. You feel me? 
You have to do tw you got to do twice as much to gain ground on someone. But if you do twice or three times the work, that means they gotta do you know they gotta multiply. You don't know how much work someone does, and they get right back. They get right back. They get right back. Give it right back. Give it right back. Trying to do too much. Doing too much. Plenty of game left, but want to get it all back at one time. And that's the issue that people have. They try to get it all back at one time instead of trying to grind and earn. They, that was, grind's a bad word. It's trying to earn their way to the top. They try to just just shoot rocks. Shoot three-pointers to get more points. That's why football, you don't get more points for throwing it deep. You get the same amount of points. They take over here with good field position thanks to that nice return after the interception. As they're already in the red this ain't basketball. And, and people play for a hey, You can't play. It ain't basketball. Yeah, they the two sports have intertwined. You feel me? The long the three pointer for the uh, long pass. But they got different rules. They got different rules. Six points is six points. It just you can't waste time. Some people don't waste time and some people waste time. And some people waste time. Some people don't waste time. They're really, really, you know, impactful with their moves. Some people are very impactful with their moves. They don't make many moves, but they're very impactful with their moves. And the route is on here in this first half. The purple people eaters out there, man. They had the short field and they made quick work of it. Just two plays. The to purple get the people eaters out there. It's just, you know, like I said, Touchdown. I just want to see will they, how they respond. And that's one thing my wife has taught me, y'all. Like, how do you respond? How do you respond from disappointment? How do you respond when things don't go your way? Do you just sulk and quit and just run away from things? Or do you find a different route, an alternate way to do things? A lot of people don't find alternate routes. A lot of people will run away from issues. That was my fault. But a lot of people run away from issues. And that's the thing with teams like this. They can't earn nothing, right? They have to take advantage of mistakes. They have to. Big plays are basically mistakes, y'all. And I'll say that all the time. Big plays, most time, big plays is people capitalizing on mistakes. It's really not an earned thing because if it happens that quick, it don't last that long. You feel me? Things that happen quick like that don't last that long. Told you. <laughs> Things that happen that quick don't last that long. And we taking it to the house. We taking it to the house, bro. We are taking it to the house. You're not gonna catch me. We taking it to the his house. We taking it to the house, my guy. Like I said, things that things that happen quick, they end quick. <laughs> things that happen quick, they end quick. Things that happen quick, end quick, y'all. And that 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 timing is perfect. Timing is everything in life. Like I said, and if it happens that quick. It can end just as fast. You want to earn everything you get in life so it lasts a long time. Like, does it make it last forever? <laughs> and ever. It's okay. We left We left one on the board. You know, we missed one. It happens. But look at the score. We don't need to be greedy sometimes. Sometimes, you know, you can afford mistakes. You don't want mistakes, but you can afford them. As this one's in the air. We still in the first quarter. We still in the first half, y'all. It's 55. It's 55 0. It's 55 0. We, we not, we not going to we, we waste time and, and record the second half. We all just going to get one half with this. Because this, we took this person. We ended this game early. We ended the game early. Why? Because we want to go home. <laughs> we had to end this game early, bro. I don't even know what that means, but that might mean something significant in my life. You feel me? But I felt like like we had to end this game early because we want to go home. We ain't trying to play with these boys. We ain't trying to keep playing with these folks. We ain't trying to keep playing with these folks. 
he got four touchdown passes in the first half. And I haven't even tried to throw the ball like that. I haven't even been trying to throw the ball like that. But well, so much holes, so many holes in the team. that They, they care about wins so much that they're not solid. They, they care about money so much that they're not solid. See? Hurt. <laughs> not solid. And that's the thing. you got to be solid out here in this world. Solid. And be able to go get yours. And don't have to worry about capitalizing in big plays. And the way this team is built, it's built on making big plays. It's not built on being solid. Not a scheme. Not not being known for something. Relying on the running game too much. Wasting time on the clock. That's how he built his team. Running the ball. Trying to waste time. Not having... Not having doing something with your time, you know. Like you can just tell how this team is built, and how you build your team, it matters. It matters. It matters. When you do fantasy drafts, you can tell how people build their team. How you build your team is how you want your family to run. Quick strikes or big plays. Capitalize on mistakes because that means mistakes happen. But are you going to learn from your mistakes? See, five, five of them bad boys, a fist, and I'm throwing a fist, a fist, y'all. I'm throwing a fist, a fist of touchdowns. That means we solid, we strong out here in the first half. Still got a whole another half of football left. Another mistake. See, my kicker, he only a pressure person. He won't pressure. Right now, he too relaxed. He's just going out there just, man, it don't mean nothing. You feel me? Like, this y'all don't mean nothing. It don't, like, when you play for nothing, y'all, you don't, you don't have a lot of focus when you're playing for nothing. But when you got everything to lose, your pride, your family, when you out there doing it for your family instead of doing it just for yourself, it matters. That jump matters. Playing soft now. Well, we'll give it the big play. Now he playing for price. Like, man, I don't want a little bit. Now, like I said, y'all, we have turned this game into practice. The whole second half will be practice. Look at him. Oh, run back on it. <laughs> Let's go. The whole second half have become. The whole second half will be practice. The whole second half will be practice. Another one. They have seven turnovers. Seven. Seven turnovers. Seven turnovers. Five touchdowns. But they got seven turnovers. And we capitalize on their mistakes. Not trying to do. Not trying to do. Oh, dang. As soon as I talk, right? It's all good. <laughs> But can they capitalize? Can they capitalize? You feel me? That's why you don't talk trash. That's why you just talk about you and you um, talk about the facts. When you talk trash, things happen. You don't kick a man when he's down. You don't kick a man when he's down. You got to respect the game, man. The only time disrespect happens is when they disrespect you. But they struggling, man. And that's a fact. They struggling. They struggling. Another one. Because I missed tackle. Went for the pick instead of just tackling them. And that's capitalizing on the mistake. And they are, and you can't win that way in life. Waiting for someone to make a mistake to actually make your move. You got to learn how to go take what you want. You got to be able to go take what you want in this world as well. You can't just wait until you have opportunity. Sometimes you got to poke and poke and poke. And you need a great woman to poke it and push you, push you further in life to do more. You know what I mean? Some people don't want to be pushed to do more. They just want to be comfortable. And being comfortable will get you behind in this world. A comfort zone when you're not even ahead in life. What's the point of being comfortable when you're not even ahead in life yet? You, you have made no progress in life. But you're comfortable. It will keep you behind. It will definitely keep you behind in this world. Definitely keep you behind in this world. 
All right, y'all. I appreciate y'all for zoning in. We'll see y'all in the playoffs. Halftime? We'll definitely see y'all in the playoffs, man. I'm K3B, man. We'll catch y'all next time. Okay, Brandon, thank you.